Hello everyone, today we, the Department of Mass Communication, is here to interact with few of our talented athletes who represented in the Nagaland Olympic and Paralympics 2024. Hello everyone, today we have the privilege of interacting with two players who played for the ongoing Nagaland Olympic. Thank you so much for giving us your time. Please tell us about yourself. My name is Viviga Yepto, representing Chumagirma District, and this is my second Olympics. Uh, my name is Kazevit Yoshokre, representing Chumagidima district. Okay, so uh, how do you feel representing your district and then since it is your second time in the Nagaland Olympics, can you please tell us about your experience? Uh, we're filled with immense pride and joy to represent our district. Uh, it, this was a great experience that we had. Uh, th since the first Olympics, uh, I think the overall court, the overall uh, administration, the management was very really good comparing to the last time and we're filled with immense joy and pride representing our district. And um, I heard that the uh, basketball court that you played was made of uh, synthetic flooring and it was also the first time in the Nagaland Olympic. So can you tell us about the uh, experience that you had playing in the synthetic floor and the normal flooring that you guys played in the past uh, games. Uh, uh, exactly. Uh, since uh, the introduction of the synthetic floor this time, uh, we had really good experience with the floor. Uh, comparing to the last time, last Olympics, uh, we had really slippery floors. Everybody had, you know, inexperiences with the floor. Uh, but this time with the synthetic floors, we had really good grips and we could really perform our well. We could really perform well and give our best. Okay. So, um, did you guys... See, uh, did you guys ever think that you would come this far? Because you guys also won in the final <coughs> final match, and you you guys scored the third bronze. I heard. Yeah. So, did you guys see coming this far? No, not exactly. But we knew that every district had come prepared, and it was a really tough match with everything. Uh, we beat uh, first with Mon, and then we Twin Sang. And then third, we played against uh, Kohima in the semis, but we lost against them. Um, but <clears throat> we came strong, all of our team with the practices we had, and all the practices, hard work we did, and I think it really paid off. Yes. And we won the third bronze, and we're really happy and glad. Well, um, I, I wish you all the best, and then we're so glad that you guys won the third place. And I just wish you best for your future endeavors. Thank you. Thank you so much. And now we have the players from the Dimapur women's basketball team. I am so honored to have you guys here. Can you guys please uh, introduce yourself? Uh, I'm Kevin Nuno and I'm representing Dimapur district. Um, my name is Sosen Tetlayer and I'm representing the Dimapur district. So how do you guys feel achieving the first place in the Nagaland Olympic women's basketball? Um, all of these we have been practicing so hard. Uh, it's it finally paid off. Yes. Mm, we have been striving for this, and then we were hungry to win this yes. gold, and then we finally achieved it. And it's all uh, God's blessing on yes. us. Uh, I'm so happy that you guys have secured the first place. So uh, throughout this journey, what was the biggest lesson that you guys have learned? Um, we gave our hundred percent and left the rest to God. Yes. To yes. Almighty God. And for me, uh, it's like uh, without God, we are nothing, and with God, we can do anything. Yes. So uh, thank you so much. I am so honored to have you guys here, and also I wish you guys the very best for your future, uh, for your future endeavors. Thank you. Thank, thank you so thank much. You. Hello, everyone, and now we have the players from the men's basketball team from Kohima. Uh, I am so honored to have you guys here and a very big congratulations to you guys for securing the first place in the Nagaland Olympic men's basketball. Uh, can you please tell us about yourselves? Uh, my name is Kenizel Kevintale uh, and I'm from Kohima district. Hi, my name is uh, Tejanguli Richard Macro. I'm also from Kohima district. So uh, you guys have secured the first place. How do you feel uh, how, how do you feel representing for your district and how is the feeling of winning in the Nagaland Olympic? Uh, it feels quite good. 
We, we have been practicing for like a month, uh, in the morning in, and in the evening. So uh, our hard work, uh, we really did it. And it, it feels good. Uh, we're also excited that uh, this is our second championship in the Olympics. Uh, being the defending champs, we were able to come up with uh, another trophy for the district and for our people. So we're really thankful to God and also thankful to the organization for you know, coming up with such a very good opportunity for all the players here in Nagat. Yes. So did you guys face any struggles throughout this journey? Uh, well, playing, uh, this is, uh, the atmosphere is totally different from the Kohima, so yes. it was quite, uh, the humid was quite uh, different. different, so a bit difficult while playing uh, in this weather. Yes. Uh, yeah, like, like you said, it was quite difficult adjusting to the weather and all, yes. since, and since we've been practicing during the winter, which, is in, which was in the month of January. Yes. So coming here in Dimapur and then suddenly, uh, you know, experiencing the hot climate, uh, it, it took, uh, you know, a big toll on our bodies as well. Yes. So uh, do you guys have any message to the viewers and also to your supporters? Yeah, uh, I want to thank everyone who, who was supporting the Kohima district. Uh, it was all because of the supporters and the grace of the God we did it. I would like to thank them. Yeah, same as him. Uh, I want to thank all the supporters who have been supporting Kohima District, and also, you know, thank uh, thank all the supporters who have been supporting the other teams as well. Uh, because of their support only, you know, we have we were able to you know pump ourselves up, and then you know get ready for the matches, get motivated and encouraged because of their support. And I would also request uh, you know the viewers and everything. Uh, since we've been watching some live games on the YouTube, I would request them that uh, you know it's just a game at the end of the day. So please don't take things. Uh, too seriously, and then please don't get into unnecessary, you know, arguments and then tribalisms and stuff like that. Yes, okay, yes. Thank you. So thank you so much for giving us your time, and I wish you all the best for your future endeavors. Thank you. Right, thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. That is all we have for now. Subscribe for more updates.